pace in the game and that's uh, critical to Indiana trailing Duke as Jeff Newton returns for the Hoosiers and Hornsby goes up. And Dick, oddly enough, Tom Coverdale was the focus of Duke's defense coming in. Rebounded by Indiana. The game is over. The Hoosiers with a major upset have defeated the number one team in the nation. Hello, my name's Tom Coverdale. Uh, sorry I couldn't be there with you in person tonight, but I wanted to help out an organization in the Boys and Girls Club that's meant a lot to me throughout my whole life. So here's kind of my whole Boys and Girls Club of Noblesville story. You know, I've been fortunate in my career to play many and basketball lead to many different things, but it all started at the Noblesville Boys and Girls Club. It was the very first basketball team I was a part of. One of my first memories is still coming to the Boys and Girls Club, the old Boys and Girls Club, and that old gym with the upstairs with my mom and dad. Still one of the loudest gyms I think I've ever been a part of. Just being in that atmosphere with your friends, being a part of a team growing up is something that I'll always remember. Other than just basketball, I think the Boys and Girls Club, what it gave me and my family and what it still gives kids today is a place to go, whether it's after school, to be a part of different programs, different sporting events. From kindergarten on, for me, it was learning how to be a part of a team, learning to get along with different kids from different neighborhoods. When you're an elementary school kid, your whole world is kind of in your elementary school. And that's something I always remember is being on a team with other kids from my town that I didn't know from school. So you're building those relationships for later on in your high school and junior high days that I think lead to success on not only athletic success, but getting to know and interact with other kids and build your own personality and find out who you really are. I was fortunate enough to go to a high level of basketball. Not everybody can make it to that level. But what the Boys and Girls Club does is it gives memories to young kids in an athletic setting that they'll remember for a lifetime. One story that comes to mind that I'll never forget I think I was in second or third grade, and we had a kid on our team. His name was Tim. Uh, he wasn't the best athlete in the world, but he was one of the most light kids on the team. It came down to the end of the game. I, of course, shot it and missed. He got the rebound. He didn't score a basket the whole year, but he got the rebound, tried to shoot it at the end of the game, got fouled, had to go to the free throw line. He hit the free throw to win the game. And unfortunately, that kid later on, you know, contracted some disease and passed away at a very young age. And I've always thought back to that moment of, if it wasn't for the Boys and Girls Club, he would have never had that moment in his life. His family wouldn't have had that moment in an athletic setting, but also in a community setting where all his peers cheered him on. And he had to have that moment to win that game. And so as I transition into now being a parent, luckily for me, me and my wife made the great decision to move back to Noblesville a couple years ago. I have two young kids that are twins that are seven years old. So of course the first thing I wanted it to get them in the after school program at the Boys and Girls Club. So both of my kids attend that. They are both playing basketball. And of course I wanted, with me having, and my family having such a great experience when I was a kid, I wanted the same things for them. And that's why my family will always be a part of and associated with the Boys and Girls Club. So it's very important for me and my family and the rest of the community, everybody's here tonight for a reason. It's to give these kids, my kids, other kids in the community, kids like Tim, a place to go to have those memories at whether it's athletically or getting involved in the community or building themselves up socially to meet other kids, this is the place and why it's so important to donate to that. You are donating to the kids of our community's future and there's no better place in the community that builds kids' futures than the Noblesville Boys and Girls Club.